So I woke up today and had some devotion and uh, I was put into the story of Mary and Martha. If you guys remember, uh, Martha is busy doing all the tasks to be done while Jesus is inside the house and Mary was just simply sitting there with Jesus talking with each other. And you know how Martha is doing, she's doing the details, cooking for everyone, everything, and she then literally realized that, wait, Mary isn't doing anything, like, huh, Jesus is here, he, she should have done something for Jesus right now, she should do the work, she should help me cook here, and do the things around the house for us to warmly welcome Jesus here. Then Martha came to Jesus, asking Mary if Mary could help her. Jesus replied that Martha is all over the place and worried about all the details. But there is only one thing that she should be concerned about, that Mary found it and discovered it. You know, most of the time we are like Martha. We are all over the place, being too much on the details of the day. And we tend to forget sitting with Jesus. And we tend to be more busy about the kingdom, but not the king. The kingdom is different from the king. Come to think of it, we're so much busy about the kingdom, like doing a lot of ministry, sharing Jesus, and everything. But when we honestly assess ourselves, are we really having a good time with Jesus? A good moment cup of coffee or tea with jesus those alone moments talking to jesus because that is what he actually needs more than what you do for his kingdom you know sometimes we have a lot of this uh, to-do list and expectations our days are packed with full details responsibilities and deadlines and we often rush out going out the door without having God in the second thought. We have a lot of things to worry about, the ministry, mounting those pressures to get it all done. And little did we know, we failed to make a room for Jesus. You know that God expects us to do our best effort, but we must always start with Him. Make room in your day to listen to the Master, to listen to Jesus, and spend time this fit and as you spend time with him he will direct you the right path that you need to do he will give you more peace on the things that you need to finish and you will be reminded of who you are and whose you are and when you keep him at the center of your work he will always make a way you don't have to get that pressure you know it's not about that performance you do in the ministry but it's about how you spend time with Jesus, your intimacy with Jesus. Regardless of your tasks today or how many details you manage, only one thing matters. Mary found it. That is spending time with Jesus. Have a great day ahead. Let's spend time with Jesus more.